Divine Feminine. <clears throat> Welcome to the Karmic Circus, where we expose all of these karmic ass clowns. I'm trying to hurry up and get to this reading. <laughs> Instead of saying the whole long little, you know, opening introduction part. But, you know, I, it's, it's the Divine Feminine out here. I'm just jumping straight off into it. And these are some new cards that I'm working with. And these cards is telling me. Now, please keep in mind that this reading ain't going to resonate with everybody. So only take the parts that fits with you and resonates with you. And leave the rest for somebody else. If it don't fit, don't force it. Just relax. And let the shit go. Okay. Now, there's a divine feminine out there. Now, I don't, I don't know. Now, you take it where it resonates. The first card that came out was Sing in reverse. So, this could mean a lot of different things. Okay? Some of you may can sing and you haven't been singing. Some of you, you may can sing and you, for some reason, you're not singing. Um, and it's been more than a year for somebody haven't been singing. Now, it's, it's, I'm feeling like whoever it is, somebody, I feel like somebody stopped you from singing. Okay. Because we have an apology out here. So somebody wants to apologize. From either keeping you from singing. Telling you you can't sing or something. They could have been saying that your voice is not good enough to sing. Or they could have been being a narcissist. Not giving you permission to sing. For some of you this may be one of your parents or somebody. A relative or. Somebody, you know, they could have told you that you won't make it trying to sing or, or something. And, and it, it was torment for you. For somebody to tell you that either you can't sing or they don't want you to sing. Or you're not going to make it as a singer. Some of you, you may have lost your voice and you haven't tried to sing. Maybe you love to sing. And it could be tormenting to you. For somebody out there, as I look at this picture, maybe, maybe your voice is cracking or something. Somebody made a firm decision that they're not going to sing no more. Or someone gave you a firm, you know, um, what's the word? Um, basically demanding that you can't sing something. Or you could have said that you're not going to sing no more. Maybe you want to torment somebody. Somebody may love your singing and you don't want to sing to torment them. Or somebody around you maybe can't sing. Or something about singing with a divine feminine. And with this cool down here and this cracked up person, maybe somebody, maybe... You stopped singing because you were singing and somebody cracked up and started laughing. So from them, they could have been telling you, you know, you really can sing, but they was making jokes about your singing, which made you stop singing and you stopped singing for over a year now. And now this could mean this, this torment could be them for somebody. I'm just reading it, you know, different ways I see it. Somebody could be 
tormenting themselves because they could have stopped you from singing by cracking a joke on your voice or something. And like I said, this is not going to resonate with everybody because everybody out there ain't no singer. So if you're not no singer, this, you know, this, this is not your reading. This is specifically for someone who sings. And I just heard that some of you, you have a beautiful voice. But the Holy Spirit don't want you in that satanic ass industry. So maybe you sing, just don't get in the industry. Don't go selling your soul and shit. So we gonna, I'm gonna see. Why, why is sing in reverse? Let's pull a little tarot. Oh, shit. This motherfucker. Here he go as I split the deck. This is Mr. Milk and Cookies. This is, this is the energy. Somebody you cannot make them happy no matter how you try is a motherfucker who probably telling you not to sing. Somebody may sing like a bird. Somebody may receive messages from birds. But if somebody out there, your voice is, is cracking or something, and maybe you need to, to uh, suck on a cough drop, I used to sing with my family and the lead singer of our group, she could hit them high notes like Mariah Carey. And she would always pop a, a, a Vicks, one of them, you know, one of them cough drops each time before we got ready to go on the floor. So, some of you, you may, you may just need to try that. You know, get a, a, a cough drop or one of them altos, what they call them, them all them different mix um, cough drops and something to lubricate your throat. Maybe the person you sung in front of, they made a joke, but they really know that you can sing and they want to apologize to you. Maybe, maybe this person, it's been more than a year that they need to apologize to you. Maybe, you know, whoever this person is, they're, they're feeling bad for stopping you from singing. That's the overall energy. And, and for somebody, you could have been singing a person who likes to sing around the house. And this 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 person, you could have been singing and they could have been telling you to shut up, your voice is cracking or something like that, but they was just fucking with you. You really can sing. They wanted your judgment possibly to be crowded, cloudy. And I also, I hadn't noticed on this card, this kind of looks like a headstone. So for some of you, somebody could have passed away and they stop you from singing or um, somebody could have passed away and you, you stopped singing since they passed away. Maybe you feel like you don't want to sing since someone passed away. You're tormenting yourself. Or someone who could have said something, you know, bad about your voice, they done passed away. If that's them, they're they're they want they're apologizing to you. One 
Why is seeing in reverse? Nine of Cups. Oh, that's why whoever this if they haven't if they haven't passed on, this is why they're they're sorry. Because it was like it was your wish come true. Something something about your wish coming true with singing. Something maybe you was about to be discovered or something. And and I feel I feel like something big happened to where you was either supposed to go or do something when it comes to your singing. It was your wish come true. Maybe you could have gone to America's Got Talent or something. I don't know, something like that. Britain's Got Talent. And this person stopped you. Or for some of you, this person could have been your wish come true. And you stopped singing because they were your wish come true. And maybe they said something. I don't know. It's different for everybody. Tell me more. Why is the scene in reverse? See? The star. That's why they sad. You're supposed to be a star. You're the star. Something about your voice and singing. And this person could have made, made you know, made you feel like you were tormenting them. If you like to walk around the house and sing, um, you may sing in the shower, sing in the bathtub, sing in the car, sing, sing, sing. And, and it's probably, this person said something about your singing. And it's like, you just stopped. And the crazy thing is, you stopped, even though they were saying it was tormenting them by you singing. When you stopped singing, it's tormenting them more. Because they know that you are supposed to be a star. Damn. Yeah, they want to apologize. If they haven't passed away, uh, they want to apologize to you. more about the scene. The Empress, this could be you, Divine Feminine. Some of you, you, you stopped singing because you got pregnant. Yeah, some of you stopped singing. Somebody stopped singing possibly because they was pregnant. And see, with the Empress out here, the Empress is all about femininity, beauty, abundance, about a pregnancy, life, death, rebirth. She could be, or you could be a Taurus or a Libra. You could be an Aquarius. Some of you stopped singing because you had a child and it's tormenting you. It's different for everybody, so you know, put it put it where it fits with you. Yeah, somebody somebody told you with the hangman energy that you must wait. Damn. See the hangman. And the devil. Wow. Okay. Somebody could have got you pregnant because they didn't want you to sing. They didn't want you to be famous. So they tried they got you pregnant for some of you. Some of you some of you your voice 
is a beautiful voice. And I hear it, it, it brings life to people, your voice. But the devil out here, Capricorn energy, the hangman, Pisces energy, the empress, Taurus, or Libra, and the star, Aquarius. So some of those signs may be significant to you. But uh, somebody is either feeling tormented because they stopped you from singing or talked you out of singing, set you up to where you couldn't sing. Um, they want to apologize. Okay. So this, this reading may or may not resonate with your energy. And if it don't resonate with you, it may resonate with somebody close to you. Okay. But still, I'm asking everyone to hit that thumbs up button to help my channel get out there in the uh, YouTube algorithm. And make sure you hit the subscribe button. Okay. Hit the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.